Hello there, Leo. Hope you're doing good. Welcome to your monthly reading. It's going to be for January 2021. And today we're talking, we're taking a look at a connection that you may be dealing with. It doesn't have to be um, a love relationship. I'm actually getting that for you. It may not be. It may be like lifestyle, just overall reading, some message that you need to hear. But I'm trying to focus on love here. It could also be about your parent, it could also be about career. So take whatever resonates, leave what doesn't. This is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, you can always check your other placements. But if it does, feel free to give it a like, subscribe, comment, anything you can do to help support and grow this channel is really, really appreciated. Don't forget to check my Instagram too, because we have weekly readings over there. And if there's ever any type of content, any reading that you would like to see, Sure, be totally free to comment down below, okay? I'll take that into consideration. Uh, before we get started, uh, I was getting, um, funny enough, your energy. <laughs> uh, I was getting the sun, uh, which is your energy. And I was also getting like this very empowering and sort of like sunrise. And uh, already seeing this blossoming here, I feel like you are becoming your most authentic self. Especially this being a 33 card master number, I feel like you're connecting with your life purpose, possibly with the one. I just feel like you're starting to become the person you always wanted to be, okay? I got this very empowering kind of energy, so that's really good. Hunger, yeah. And faith. And look, this gives me like Empress vibes for me because she's like pregnant of the world and actually in the light seer sorrow. Um... The Empress is pregnant of the world. And it's you being pregnant of your own beliefs, you being pregnant of your own ideas and giving birth to those, okay? Accomplishing everything or starting, starting everything that you want to accomplish, you know, a lot of movement forward into in your career, a lot of movement forward in your life, and things are just starting to grow, okay? But let's see where this goes. Again, I'm not getting necessarily that this is about love it may be about career okay something that you may need to know please don't run away but we'll see we'll see what happens okay it's just one message that i'm i'm getting is that this month it's actually interesting that we see here the hangman um instead of being in that hangman kind of place where you're you may be waiting for something or I don't know everything's very stagnant and you're trying to like okay I'm waiting um what's what am I supposed to do you know instead of being there try to take action towards the things that you want okay bottom of the deck we do have the devil nine of wands world nice where I feel like you're standing up for yourself by standing up for yourself you're saying hey this is not what I want Devil is not what I want. Toxic relationship is not what I want. What I want is the king of cups. What I want is love. Okay. Let's see where we go here. So we have over here the queen of cups. Very nice. Um, I'm kind of getting that um, until now, you may have always been in a place of not necessarily that I'm not enough, that I'm not good enough, but I'm, it's almost like I'm not strong enough. I don't have that anger. Like, I'm not able to do this because in your block is this ace of swords. It's like, well, maybe not yet, maybe not yet. Especially having this four of swords here in the past is, well, maybe I still have a lot to work. Maybe I still have a lot to improve. Maybe I'm not the king of wands yet. And the thing is, you are. The thing is, you are, okay? And with this Five of Cups, there may be... I don't know. I feel like you may be blaming yourself for something that didn't happen. Either in a relationship, in career, maybe there was something that you wanted to do and you didn't do. And now you're like, well, that, that's it. I had my chance, I didn't use it, now there's nothing I can do. And there is. I feel like it's um, it's about you realizing that. It's about you acknowledging that, well, yeah, I do have, I do am, I am, 
I do am <laughs> what I am the king of wands. I have what it takes. Okay? Because right now I feel like you're sort of blocking yourself, almost stopping yourself. It's like sometimes you have that hunger and you're like, oh, I'm just gonna go get it. I'm just gonna go do this. I'm just going to give birth to that idea. I'm just going to start this. And then you stop yourself and like, no, wait, no, you can't because you're not that. You actually are. Okay? High priestess here, listen to your intuition because your intuition is telling you what is possible and what is not possible here. Okay? With this Knight of Swords on uh, your immediate future and the Eight of Pentacles on the potential outcome, there is a lot of work that's coming in, especially if this is around career. Um, I really feel like you have a lot of things to work on. You'll have a lot of things to do. You'll have a lot of things to move forward. Okay? And I kind of feel like that is in your hopes and you don't really realize that you already have that. That that is already coming towards you. It's like you're imagining that and you're like, oh, you know, one day I would love to have a lot of work to do. I would love to do this and that and the other. And you already can. Okay? I really feel like things are moving really fast. If this is about a relationship, I really feel like there is going to be a lot of work that needs in the relationship in the sense that I feel like you'll need to affirm yourself in the things that you want, the things that you don't want in a relationship, how you got hurt in the past and how you don't want that to happen again, how that is not healthy for you. And the other person may need to do that a little bit. I kind of feel like the other person may be a little bit following your lead. So that is why you need to really be sure that you are the king of wands okay really affirm yourself in that position because right now you may definitely be against your leo because you're more in this queen of cups energy of i don't know more loving not that the king of wands is not but more connected with other people and not really with yourself and the advice here is connect with yourself connect with your higher self Connect with your best version. And you'll see that you already are your best version. Okay? And it's really important that you are in that place so you can move things forward. Because I really feel like you're going to be the, um, the leader here in this relationship. Okay? But let's clarify some stuff. Let me see that queen of, of cups in your current situation. So we have, yeah, we have the five of ones, the magician, and the six of pentacles. It's again, I feel like you're really focused on helping others, on doing things for others, on being there for others, helping, you know, uh, giving advice, and not really trusting your manifestations. You may even be telling people like, hey, you can manifest, you can create your dreams, you can make them come true. It's like you're trying to teach that to other people. And when it comes to you, you're like well other people can do it I can't not true okay I really feel like it's time for you to reconnect with yourself let me see this ace of swords three wands hangman ace of cups it's like well it's just not my time it's just not for me it's just, I still have a lot to figure out. It's that hangman, four of swords. I still have a lot to heal. I still have a lot to improve. You already have two freaking aces telling you it's time to go, okay? It's time to accomplish. It's time to do things because you can do things. It may come in a very, at least right now, it may be very slowly. You may need to, um, to sort of do the transition into the knight of swords and so you don't like burn yourself out or something like that. But I do feel like things will eventually move really, really fast here. Okay? Let me see that. Two of swords. Page of wands. Seven of wands. Eight of swords. And the hermit. Yeah. it's You're being guide, a, a guide to others. A guide to your friends. And you're not listening to your own advice. It's like you have this really good idea, have this really good impulse of starting new things, of that faith, of giving birth. Because this faith, I, I'm actually saying like this is Empress. <laughs> I'm just, uh, it's, it's more of the imagery here that matters than the, the word itself. 
but you are already that empress and sometimes you feel that urge of okay let me create something but the second you feel that you're like oh no wait 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 no come on what did you what did, what did we talk about you're not the king of wands you do not have what it takes to create this bs okay you're telling yourself bs so tell yourself a different story tell yourself that you actually are that you actually can all right and let that imagination flow let those ideas flow okay let's see the high priestess here Ooh, come here have the wheel of fortune the seven of cups strength eight of eight of uh, ones things are really changing for you and it's that thing you'll soon have so many things to do <laughs> so many things that i feel like you will even be a little bit hard to breathe because you're always trying oh my god i need to do that i need to do that uh, don't feel like you burn yourself out it may come to that point to be quite honest but well, if you keep visiting me, if that happens, hopefully I'll tell you, hey, slow down. But right now, it's really about moving. It's really about, you got to start doing this. No more holding back. No more waiting around. Things are ready to be blossomed. Things are ready to go. All right? Let me see this uh, Knight of Swords. I really feel like for most of you, this is um, going to be career, okay? But again, it could definitely be around uh, love, all right? Just take it however resonates. We have the moon, the king of swords, there it is, sun, your energy, queen of pentacles, is you finally connecting. It's like the moment, the moment you turn on the light and you're like, oh shit, I am, I am the king of wands. It's like all of a sudden, boom, things just happen <laughs> magic happens okay because judgment because it is meant to happen it was just waiting literally was just literally waiting for you to wake up how simple is that easier said than done but it was basically that okay let me see the eight of pentacles Three of Cups, Death, Star, Nice, Ten of Pentacles, a lot of options, yes, a lot of opportunities, yes, a lot of money, yes, a lot of commitment potential, yes, a lot of wish fulfillment, yes, okay, all that because you did the work of, I'm seeing this almost like um, pros and cons list, <laughs> Uh, like, even if this is for love, it's like, hey, I want this in a relationship. I don't want this. So what's it going to be? Are you in the same page? And that's when things shift from a mere friendship, from a mere, oh, we have so much fun, to a life partner, to your wish fulfillment, okay? And all, the same goes for a career, right? As we've been discussing, you knowing that, okay, this can actually work. This, maybe not. And you, you do that, distinct, that distinction from your intuition, okay? You start going from, oh, I have so much fun, to, oh my god, I have so much fun, but I'm kind of dying with all the work I have to do. But I'm having a lot of fun. I'm, I'm really being happy, okay? That's looking so good. So let's pull here some messages and advice from the universe. Nothing, really? Okay. Nah, I was just, just warming up. Let's see. So, we have home. I do feel like you're kind of comfortable. Too comfortable. Okay? <laughs> we have self-codependency. It's you knowing your power. Gift yourself with your wishes. Okay, your wishes are coming true. Go towards your wishes. Wake up. See, that may actually be the title of this video. Uh, it's up to you to take things forward, to move things. And ask for help. 
this time it's not about you giving and spending more time on others it's about you spending more time on you okay you may need to ask for help you may need to talk to friends to see what's going on but it's about you okay now it's about you let's pull some um fairies oracles of fairies here it's kind of being drawn to it Okay, so we have healing, all right, we have music, and guess what, guess what, we not only have blossoming, we, all, we also have flourish, okay, again, you're becoming the person you always wanted to be, all right, and with this healing, I feel like it's about, um, it's that sort of shadow work, that healing that needs to happen where you don't feel empowered, where you don't feel the king of wands, okay? I'm kind of getting affirmations. May do you very good. But also, like, for example, um, I, keep, I keep getting lists. <laughs> I keep getting lists. Um, write a list of accomplishments, of things that you are proud of, okay? Write a list of your dreams, of your ideas, okay? And do them. With this music, you are definitely receiving messages through music, okay? If you are, if we're talking here about a, a path in music, go for it. Don't even think twice, okay? And no, yeah, friendship, so ask for help. And tree of tree wisdom. You have that wisdom, okay? You have that wisdom. So yeah, that's it. <laughs> Leo, this is what I have for you. I hope it resonated. Hope it helped. If it did, don't forget to smash that like button. It really helps. Subscribe. Um, you know, just anything. I would really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.